So, about that character mix-up. What character mix-up? You know, like I was on Kasai's no, Corner. No, you weren't. Or you were on my music no, with no, Jonah. With Jonah? Yeah, you don't like Jonah now? No, that. Well, I never Why said that. Why don't you like Jonah? I just, he has his segment, I have mine. I don't have a problem with him as a person. What happened just... to wanting to quote like him in the beginning of all this? Quote like, uh, with you see that. You were reading like so many books. Yeah, and I got tired of it. My head started hurting. Alec and, and Jamie were sitting here doing hosts. I would never let Alec host, ever. Just, no, that's giving him too much power. He already wants to be the star of the show. It's just a bad idea altogether. Okay, well, like. <laughs> Oh, hey, and I was going, uh, where's Jeff? How you guys? No, you, what is wrong with you people? We all do our normal jobs. What There's, do you mean, you people? What, you There's you never people? been a change. <gasps> we've always done what we've, the old person's You ever, know what, I'm done. Welcome to the show. <laughs> Am I going Enjoy. to or something? So did you hear about that Fox newscaster? Uh, the one who says mixed up NAACP and NCAA? Yeah, she yeah. said the Husky, the Yukon Huskies were part of the NAACP. I mean, I'm sure a few of them were. I mean, I'm pretty sure the whole team is, but... What, what, what is that supposed to mean? Nothing. Uh, Nothing at all. Well, that rat on the train. Oh my, remember that time at shop when we had that mouse in shop? Man, that was like this! I bet you that's what they were on the train! Man, but rats are big, we only had a mouse. And it, they didn't know until they were on the tunnel. Like, a rat is this big. That rat was big. That rat is big. I would have pooped my pants. I would have pooped my pants. <gasps> I don't know, man. Me neither. I would have been scared. For a train ride? And he was already in the tunnel? It was dark too? I already said that, but yeah. So what? I don't know. Cannot find Reality Sys Universe Halted. My software never has bugs, it just develops random features. Definition of an upgrade, old bugs out, new bugs in. Bad command or file name, go stand in the corner. On a further note, why doesn't it ever say excellent command or file name? As a computer, I find your faith in technology amusing. Southern DOS, y'all reckon? Yep, nope. File not found, should I fake it? Yeah, no. Ethernet, now, something used to catch the ether bunny. <laughs> Oh man, a computer's attention span is as long as its power cord. This information is not as good as that information. <laughs> Windows, just another pain in the glass. Go ahead, make my data. Smash forehead on keyboard to continue. Press any key to continue or any other key to quit. The student of the week is Brylin Brothers. The staff of the week is Mr. Green and the teacher of the week is Ms. Hale. So are you serious? I'm on the same segment, just without Tiffany. How am I supposed to be the star of the show? Well, technically, you were by yourself, and story, so... Well, true, true, but I'm trying to take your spot. Over my host. dead body. Welcome to episode 28. As you know, I'm Alec. And I'm Jamie. Okay. So, we had three very wrong answers this week. Uh, one was in a janitor's closet, the other one was under a chair, and the third wrong answer was in the basement. Nope, none of those are correct. But let's see later if you guys do get the answer. Oh, wait. I'm not on that segment anymore. Come on, I want to be the star of the show. That's all I want.
Hey guys, we have a record of eight answers this week. The first one comes from Jeff who said, talk on the phone, the conversation feels more like you're in person. Robin thought the same way when she said, I prefer talking on the phone. The conversation seems to be a lot better and I don't have to wait 20 minutes for a reply. Kat also agreed when she said, both. I say this because there are times when, I, when you can't talk out loud or the other person you're talking to can't, so you have to talk through text. But once you can talk out loud, I prefer that better. Our final phone answer was Austin who said, phone, I'm too lazy to text. Now for our texter, Christy. She said, texting because it's fast and you don't drop your call or worry about not being able to hear the person you're talking to. Mandy, Billy, and Andy were undecided. Mandy said, I'm a halfer. Conversation is more instant on the phone, but you get to think of your replies if you're texting. Billy said, it depends on the situation. And finally, Andy said, depends if it's a social interaction or a brief exchange of the information. You guys did great last week for all these answers. Let's keep it up this week. Now we asked this back in season one in the jungle. I like hip hop and R&B. Country. Thank you. My favorite type of music is game soundtracks. So I've decided that this week's question is going to be, what is your favorite type of music and why? Emphasis on the why. Airplane pilots and co-pilots are required to eat different meals. Cut out all these exclamation points. An exclamation point is like laughing at your own joke. F. Scott Fitzgerald. Darn. I was hoping no one would notice. I guess I actually have to try to make my own jokes now. Jonah. <sighs> it's nice to be in carpet. <coughs> Man, it's dusty in here. So, do you want to build a house? No? Snowman? It doesn't count anymore. Whatever, I don't care. So anyway, it's Jeff here, back again with the polls. So last week, we asked you about what you like to drink. Do you guys prefer coffee or hot chocolate better? And actually, it turns out 50-50. So uh, you guys are pretty even on that stuff. Now, we're going to switch, switch it over here to food. Now, typically in the American family, you uh, eat breakfast, lunch, and then dinner, three meals a day. So we wanted to know, do you guys do that? Do you, uh, you know, so yes, no, or go make me a sandwich, because, you know, that's the American thing. Now, building houses is the American thing, too. You know, we have a pretty good housing market. So the highlights of the week. Prom guest forms are due April 30th. And prom tickets go on sale April 14th through May 5th. Also, congratulations to all the winners of Skills USA last night. Uh, we had 71 total. So you go, guys. Wow, that's pretty good. Hey, guys. We did actually get an answer close enough. Andy said that he's in wood shop. So, but in Del Castle, we call that carpentry. Close enough, I guess. Good job, Andy. And the hint for this week is that Jeff is at the beginning of the alphabet. Hey there, guys. So this week's winner was Radioactive by Imagine Dragons. And this week's picks are... Roar by Katy Perry. Radioactive by Imagine Dragons. Lightning by Cash Cash featuring John Resnick. Go vote! It's really starting to warm up. I know, we're finally crossing into the 70s. We're finally getting whether we actually enjoy. If it could just rain a little less now. So that's it for this week. What are you doing, Kenzie? People keep popping up from behind here throughout the whole seasons that we have done, and I can never find them. I don't, I don't know. I don't understand. First, you fit. What the?
I did a great job hosting last week, didn't you I? You did not host! Where did you come from? And why do you say that you hosted? Because I did. It was oh. Alec. I would never let Alec host! That's it for this you week, guys. Your own dreams. Have a great weekend. We'll see you next week. Bye! <laughs> I just, I can't, I don't know anymore. Those are prima donna. Yeah, really. Do you want to host with me? Sure. Hop on over. Welcome to Castle. This is how next week's episode will be. Yep. See you guys soon. <laughs>